Well, it is never too late to make a difference in the life of an animal. Joining us this week is Jennifer Shakirky from the Columbia County Humane Society, and she is here to introduce us to Harley, who is just a sweetheart. She is. She's very calm. She's ready to play right now, so she's getting a little antsy. But as soon as you walked in, I mean, she was just right by you. She's, mm -hmm. she's attached to you. She's a lover. She's a lap dog. She's a, a big she's lap dog. She's a big lap dog. But not too big. My no. dog's about 50 pounds, and she looks almost the same size as, as he is. Oh. Now, um, do you know, she's obviously mixed breed. She's a plot hound mixed with Whippet. Okay. She's beautiful. Harley, come here. Now, do you know, <laughs> what can you tell us about her history? Is she... Um, um, she was originally from the shelter. Uh, she came back to us. She was resurrendered in December. She was getting a little nervous with the kids. They were getting a little bit older, and kind of running through the house. So maybe a household with um, older children yes. or with no children. Yeah. Now, do we know, um, is she good with, with other animals? Um, it takes her a little while to warm up to dogs. She gets a little, a little bit barky with them. But after a little while, she seems to warm up and starts to play a little bit. Okay, and as, uh, as far as training, do we know her, her background on whether she's um, trained at all? It looks like uh, she, she sits pretty well. She, she does. She was originally house trained. Uh, we do recommend crate training to get her back into the household routine. But she's pretty good. We'll have her up front with us all day with no accidents. She'll just sit there and greet everyone when they come in. And she's very friendly, not skittish at all with, with strangers. She walked right in well, here and, and said hello. And you said she's been there for a while, since she's December. She's been here so since we December. definitely want to want to find her a forever home. Now, how are you folks doing with capacity? I know sometimes seasonally um, you, see, you see more animals. We're pretty there. full again right now with dogs. Luckily, we're a little bit low on cats for the moment, but our dogs are pretty full. Okay, so we definitely want to find Harley a forever home. Now, do you have uh, some events coming up, some fundraisers, if people want to help, come help out the Columbia County Humane we, Society in Portage? Um, in June, we have the Critter Cruise, which is a motorcycle poker run that they're doing, and we also have our annual garage sale coming up. Okay, so, and people can find out more information about those, I assume, online, online. at your website. Now, Harley, you want to take a look at the camera? Can we get <laughs> you to look at the camera? Because you are just a sweetheart. Can you turn around? Oh. All right. Well, she's she ready is, to go down. <laughs> she's ready to to find herself a forever home and jump on a couch and just relax. Yes. Well, Jennifer, thank you so much for being with us thank today. You. We certainly hope to uh, next week at this time say Harley has found a home. All right. Thanks for making the trip and waking up with us. Well, we do have an update to our pet of the week last week. You'll remember Hemingway, our pet from Dane County last week. On Thursday, he found his forever home. We are happy to report.